My name is um, Irewale John Ayodele. Um, I'm from Lagos, Nigeria. Uh, I study MSc Petroleum Geoscience at the University of London. It has broadened my horizon um, because my job entails um, seismic interpretation, petrophysical interpretation, reservoir modeling, and the integration of data, you know, logs, seismic, you know, to, uh, for prospect generation. Uh, but um, during my MSc, I was fortunate to um, go through some modules like petroleum geoscience and petroleum uh, systems, like sedimentology, structural geology, you know, reservoir geosciences, uh, which actually helped me in, in the integration of engineering, biostratigraphy, and some other geological and geophysical data. The support was fantastic, you know, in terms of um, response from the lecturers, you know, um, again, they were willing. Um, to go beyond even giving us their official mail, they went ahead to give us, you know, personal emails and numbers, you know, to communicate with them. And you know, the speed of response was fantastic. And then um, the interaction, uh, even up to now, we still interact with our lecturer even after graduation, which is nice. As part of the MSc uh, degree, uh, there was a compulsory two weeks uh, field trip that you have to embark on. And um, we had that one last year in May 2012. Um, and in that particular field trip, uh, we had some uh, world class lecturers. We had international students from Russia, from United States, uh, from Nigeria, uh, from Canada, you know, truly international environment. The field trip was fantastic. Imagine going to the, to the field throughout the day and then uh, work overnight to to deliver you know, the coursework and some of the assignment being given. But it was a um, very memorable moment for me. Definitely I would recommend the University of London because um, it's giving me the flexibility to do my MSc uh, while still working. And then even at the moment, I've already recommended to my friend in Chevron, in Shell, in Adax, you know, in Ajib, and some other um, oil companies in Nigeria.